Hey everyone, Z1 here. Uh, today I am going to teach you how to run a Java class file, which actually is a lot harder than it seems. You can't just double click it. You have to use like a batch command or something. But um, first you make your Java program. So gonna type something real quick here okay so here's my simple program I'm gonna save it on the desktop and uh, when you do something this way you need to the title of the program is the class so in this case it's main it has to be the exact name of the class here okay then dot java not dot txt do not do it as txt it won't run okay then then just like save See, .java. I have it opening with Google Chrome because I was trying to run it in the browser, but now that I know how to run it, I don't need to do that. Okay, so now I can close this. Don't need it. Now, uh, I'm going to navigate, but um, some just have to type Java C and then file. But uh, I have to do it a different way. I have to do uh, this. I have to go to this location here. Uh, you, you can do that by typing chdir change directory in the command prompt okay so uh, then I can I can turn echo off I'm gonna clear the screen again so now you type Java C because Java C dot exe there it's actually in there so you can type Java C and then the file path So, uh, I'm going to type the file path real quick, but I'm basically going to go to the desktop. So, be right back. Can't let you see my path, file path. But uh, before I do that, one more thing. When you type it, I'm just going to show you an example. So, you want to do this. Uh, replace inside the square brackets with your use with your username for the PC. So, okay, then uh, desktop slash the file dot Java and then that. Okay, so I will be right back. Okay, so I did that. Uh, now you'll see right here a class file. A uh, dot class. Uh, I did that by doing that. It does take a little while to do. Like it takes like a few seconds or a minute, maybe. But uh, once once you have have it done, you can run it easily. I'm gonna go to the desktop. So again, I will be right back. Okay, did that. I am now aimed at my desktop. So now I just have to do Java and then file name. Do not do dot class. Just Java main. 
See? Right there. Java main. Oh. This is what happens if you do it with the file type. Anyway, that's how you do it. Uh, it's an alternative. You don't need to do the JDK, or sorry, JAR. You don't need to export to JAR, which I will show you how to do soon. This next video here, just after this. Um, okay, see you next video.